How's it going everybody, Stu and Cherry here, and today's video looking at DGLY. Great day for this ticker on actually no news. It did, uh, did pump up pre-market, did a great pullback to 420. Congratulations, you guys caught that. Great support at 480. And right now we do have support at 5.505. It depends right now, that's VWAP, so it depends right now if it can break it. Hopefully not, looking for the future. And we're going to have 540 right now, the high of the day. Go ahead here and change that. So like I said, no news, but a good a good day for this one. Great amount of volume. Take a look at the 10-day chart. You'll see here that that 540 is a key level to break. And then you got uh, $6, 730 and then 7 to 80 and then up there at $7.10 for the ultimate high. Now, with this pullback, we can see an uptrend as... Uh, I'll pull the news in a second, but on the 12th, they did regain compli compliance with the NASDAQ. So that's going to help the stock go up. And then we get some more PR that will really send this up. So I'm, I'm bullish on this long term if we can get a PR upcoming weeks. I guess I'll make a correction here. The volume was was below the 10 day average it was at 20 million and uh, 10 day average at 38 million. So so a good a good move on lower than the average volume so i don't think if, if it will if it will come down again 422 will be the ultimate um support as it will literally just be putting it back where it was but we do have small re re um, support at 480 and five dollars if it won't break it anytime soon um after hours and then the the first resistance at 428 and then up there at 540 540 is the all um uh, this is now 540 is the ultimate resistance to break for a push higher and a push back up to seven dollars all right that was dgly thanks for watching make sure you guys give the video a like subscribe if you haven't write the comments opinions drop them down below and i'll see you guys in the next one and i appreciate over 1100 subscribers it means a lot see you guys in the next one